Hello and welcome to my first speedruns of 2022 after I had a two year long hiatus mainly to do GT5 no damage runs. The run I'm doing right now is Trail Percent which is up until the end of the first heist and I can't use taxis or the in-game mission skip feature. I've been practicing for like a week, learning all the new strategies that have been developed over the last two years and I am okay at them. I would definitely fail things, but this is a no reset run, so regardless of what happens, I'm not going to reset. My main goal is basically to be like, hey, this is a new strategy, and this is the strategy I'm trying to do, regardless of whether I do it well. So by the end of this run, you'll be like, well, those are all the new strategies that have been developed in the last two years. So, yeah. Okay. This guy's leg, this guy's jacket, this guy's leg. The fastest way to do this. Wow. The strategies of GTA 5 speedrunning. So I'm in first person here, so I'm first person after this little cutscene. Normally jumping indoors in third person is fastest movement, but in this particular scene, going in first person is faster, because I need to do a bunch of turns. So I gotta go turn. Turn. Round here, and then jump. Jumping in first person is normally slow, but because I'm hitting a cutscene trigger here, I don't actually experience the slowdown effects of the jump. So then, third person jumping here. Forget a thousand things every day. How about you make sure this is one of them? So, bang. I did have to do that, Michael. It's a part of the game. <laughs> I've only made that joke 800 times. And I'll do it in 800 and first, you can guarantee. So this is a small skip to open the shutter switch faster and avoid Brad's dialogue. No one gets it consistently. I mean, probably at best people get a 50-50. Lining myself up here. Ooh, I got it, nice. Yay me. Okay, reloading. Um, is my DPI correct? I don't think it is. But I can, I can manage this. It's fine. Okay, well, this is not good. I should not have reloaded that. Um, so using tab movement here to move fast, I have to stop because return to crew popped up early. So hopefully I won't fail here. But it is possible. Okay, now we're fine. Tab movement is when you bring out and put away your weapon over and over again after you've recently failed, uh, fired your gun and it makes you go that little bit faster. It has something to do with being in combat mode and it makes you about 10% faster. Depends on the character. So that shootout wasn't very good, but it's fine. Because the main thing I'm probably going to fail is this next part. I hope the local yokel survives. Be a damn shame if he would have died me never learning his name. Oh no! Oh no, Chad. Nameless henchman, down for the count. This drive is a bit annoying because for reasons unknown, the speed of your vehicle can vary considerably. It's likely just due to, you know, whether you hit certain bumps or something. But staying to the right seems to make you go faster. Uh, it's not a huge difference, but possibly determined by whether you get to a certain gear at a certain point or something, I don't know. Uh, so I'm stopping here. Want to do a train skip. Making the oil go out. I mean, petrol, whatever. So I want to dive and use my 30 FPS limiter. Um, a little bit far away here, because I'm at a, at a timer here. Oh no. Ah! The timer is what gets me. Like, I'm nervous. I'm like, oh no, I need to be quicker! No, no, yeah, fail. Uh, my angle was bad, so I clipped the back of the car, and my, so my bullet didn't hit the petrol. The time save is about 40 seconds, so under normal circumstances, when you fail this, you'd just reset. But uh, I'm not resetting. Because I mainly want to do some runs to practice all the strats. I mean, I was just showing you guys how you can fail. You see, I'm just that nice of a guy. You know? Okay. D 
Didn't... Ah, oh, no, went about as far as last time. Okay. Now aim so you don't move too slow on the... That looks fine to me. Yep. Okay. Why couldn't I have done that the first time? Well, because I wanted to be educational and tell you guys how not... How... Like, how you're not meant to do that, you see? I'm... I'm magnanimous. I swear to you, since GT5 came out, my usage of the word magnanimous has increased like 10,000%. Because of uh, Michael saying it on marriage counseling. How magnanimous! Can't I skip the cutscenes? You, you think I'm going to, to such a thing to like shoot and destroy my car at a particular frame and I can skip the cutscenes? Wait, no. Think it, obviously no. You can in mission replays though, which makes the inability to skip these cutscenes even more frustrating. Because the functionality to skip them exists in the game, it's just not allowed for your first playthrough. And it's like, why? Because they let every other cutscene be skipped, but not these ones. What was so important about the prologue cutscenes? Rockstar likes beanies. And funerals. That you will show mercy to our friends. Grand Theft Auto 5. Just in case you weren't sure of the game that you purchased. Your son, James. He's a good kid. Come on. Goodbye, levitating cat. So I'm gonna take cover here and get in the car. It's a little bit faster, apparently. So, I'm look down on my car here to uh, stop some cars from spawning that can block my sight or my trajectory or whatever the fuck it's called. Going up here with this turn. Turn was pretty mediocre. Getting the old Lamar boost hasn't changed in seven years or eight years, or however long this game has been here. Um, one brake boost here. Power off a curb. Powered brake boost. Was not particularly amazing. Slowing down. Even braking a bit. Turning. Doing this brake boost that I still don't know where it is. Yep. Still can't get that one. It is illusory, that brake boost. Doing one here. So the idea here is I can't go too fast or I will lose Lamar. So I want to go as fast as I possibly can without losing him in various different spots. So it is conceptually possible that at various different points here, I could be going a little bit faster. But if you go too fast, of course, you're losing. So it's bad. Uh, uh, break boost on this arrow. Um, Pound don't want a break boost here, break boost on that red. And I, I'm missing like every break boost here, that's fucking crazy. I don't usually miss those break boosts. My game is stuttering a little bit, which is not good. That's not the reason I'm missing them. Turn here. I guess I'm just nervous because my first run back. Slowing down a lot, turning in. Okay. So I'll do the escape here, even though it's very hard. Still got it. This escape is kind of lame because while it can save you two seconds, for some reason it can randomly re-add the cop sometimes. I'm trying to despawn a cop that's down there. I did. I succeeded. I'm the best. Um, can I still beat this car? car? Uh, no, I can't. That's great. Well, that hasn't happened in 10,000 years. I want to call that bad RNG, but I also was just bad. It's both, as is usually the case. So I've lost like a bajillion hours worth of time, but that's okay. Because at least we're having fun. Can you have fun while losing time? Of course. There's a strategy here where you uh, use ult to interrupt uh, Simeon's dialogue, but if you fail it, you lose time. Uh, and doing it is like frame perfect or some shit, so no. No one does it, except like one guy. Using emergency services here to manipulate the dialogue, or rather cut it off at particular points. Break Hello, boost. Um, break boost. Require. I require no emergency services. Uh, power here. Curve in. It's a little bit late on hanging out with that phone. 
Little bit late. Up, can the come up in your I am skipping. Shut up, chat. Are you to me tonight, Jump. Jump. Can I make it? Uh, yeah, made it. Cool, cool. Okay. First mid-drive speed boost. Um, got it. Uh, uh, no. Well, I couldn't get that brake boost there. And I curve into here, and then into here. Okay. Put. So mid-drive speed boost is before you change into third gear, you stop accelerating and you tap your handbrake and then you accelerate again. And it gives you a speed boost. And you can hear your engine go, vah, 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 at least with uh, most engines. That one's easy to get, I usually fail this one. I never took you to be all hairstylist type bitch. I actually got that, wow. See, I just like, kind of like exploded out there and then I missed, the okay, no, I actually got the brake boost, okay, well. Yeah, see, a lot of speed. Gotta slow down a bit, because this jump you need to be a bit slow off. Ah, uh, no, the warp. Oh, God. Okay. Um, brake boost. Uh, it was a little bit early. Brake boost. That's fine. Okay. I don't think either of those were particularly good. Okay. These people, though. Oh, God, I should just hit them. Ah. That's scary. Spin to win. Just trying to get Lamar lined up with the uh, gate, basically. And now we push Lamar's ass. There's a lot of ass pushing in this run these days. Because ass pushing is fun. It's not really. It kind of is. I'm on the fence, basically. I mean, at least I climbed over the fence, I mean. I'm so lame! Yeah, so I don't want to get in front of Lamar or it slows me down. I can't push him too far though, or else uh, I can't skip the dialogue, which I'm skipping by jumping forward. Like this shit, one bit. He doesn't like this shit, chat. He ain't a fan of the speed ones. Why do I park the car like that? Why does everyone always ask that? It's to hopefully make it so it doesn't despawn. Okay. So then I want to tab to bring out my gun, miss a shot, it's uh, intended, I swear. And I want to shoot this guy here, shoot this guy, oh, okay, well, I'm about to die, sweet, I got, whatever, okay. Uh, I do not know where my shot went. This is the worst run I've done since coming back. Every single practice I did was way better than this. This is embarrassing as shit. Where the hell did my shot go? Is my F- Okay, I think I might be on the wrong DPI profile. Where's the other guy? Are you- What are you doing over there? Are you- Somebody tell them niggas this illegal repossession. You sure pick the right people to pick a fight with, nigga. Awkward. Man, we only came here- Fucking hiding off to the side. Using tab movement a lot here. Oh, come on, I pressed F when I was next to it, Franklin, please. Work with me here. Okay, I've changed my DPI profile now. Should be fine. I should have changed it in prologue when I identified that I was on the wrong one. But that's okay. It's fine. Oh, yeah, the explosion there is uh, pretty bad. It's loud for some reason. So going over uh, curbs here with this bike makes it so you can wheelie for a bit and give you additional speed, which is nice. Uh... Oh crap, that car is gonna fuck me. Okay, can I still make this? Probably not. Mm, no, no, no. That car was perfectly suited to fuck me. This is, uh, this is the worst run ever. I've, I've succeeded in literally nothing. In practice, I would fail in like one thing, uh, and now I'm just failing everything. But that was only partly my fault. Like that was uh, a pretty poor setup of vehicles, if I do say so myself. What if I got a tap on my power or something and fixed it? So I'm, yeah, I'm like, I don't know, like, many minutes behind my baby. <laughs> Awful. So diving off here to skip some dialogue. Man, cool. This run is just, com like, testing my commitment to coming to back to speedrunning. Because if I'm willing to put up with this shit, I'm willing to put up with anything. So using my power there to stop some Tanya's dialogue. 
Hey, look, let's turning out here so Tanya doesn't stop. Nigga, you need to slow it down. Tanisha was right. Power um, over here, mid drive. This red car is perfectly in my way to stop my brake boost. That's perfect. That's great. Uh, right, it's beautiful. So I've also not been able to uh, stop Tanya's dialogue because I hit Trump that wall. Normally what you do here is you balance Tanya's dialogue so it stops the second you get to the car. When I say balance, I simply mean interrupt her dialogue a bunch with uh, the car. We both know you always been sweet on me. <laughs> now, I know I said I wouldn't reset, but I don't think I can put this on YouTube. Because this is like really embarrassing. Use my power here on the curb. Use my power on this red. The idea here is to use your power like, I think it's just before you gear change. Nervous say, yeah, I'll just have really, really, really bad splits. It's fine. Whatever you say, girl. Come on. Okay. So control, do this. Okay, we are in baby. Power on the top here, power going down. It's all about the gears. Um I know what the fuck I'm doing here. I guess I go around here. Lose a little bit of time. Already lost a lot, who cares? So going into here, brake boost. Uh, not brake boost, sorry, I'm just power. Probably a little bit late, actually. Should have done that a little bit earlier. Ah, uh, no, please, I, I hate you. Okay, we're fine, it's fine. He was kind. I'm still not going over this curve here. Oh, you come on, dude, stop it, please. So I'm trying to control the dialogue here. Yeah, it's all right. see you on the block. It's okay. Me, you now the fun begins. Now, where is that phone? Okay. I uh, shouldn't have used my power there, actually. Still got the mid-drive speed boost. Um, brake boost here that I never get. Uh, it's still too early. This one here. Perfect. Oh, but he's leaving the other door? Get out of here. Okay, I've never seen that before. It's an inaccuracy. Okay. I didn't get the ability to move, which is going to make this a little bit harder now. Are you... Move. I'm, I'm stuck. I can't... You're... I have to leave his area of influence. I'm not going to make it. There's no fucking way I'm going to make it. Uh, you driving. No, eh, okay, it might work, it should work, it's fine. So he walks past that and then he warps in. Where the fuck is Chop? Why did Chop take so long? Hello? Whatever. So... This drive is like the hardest drive for me. Okay, we'll try it. Mid drive. Got like nothing out of the mid drive or my attempt at a shitty power thing there. Um, okay, got that. Got that. Ah, that'll do. Okay. Okay. Speed's fine, I guess. That's not too bad. That was obviously another power. Oh, you're kidding! Of all the places for you to be, sir, you had the entire world. Dialogue is. Oh, this dialogue's awful. What is this dialogue? What's up, bro? Hundred years! Empires rose and fell in the length that that dialogue went. So I didn't do tab movement here, which I should have done. So now I want to power, go off here, here, mid-drive. Uh, you got nothing there. Bring up the uh, phone here. So this cab is in the worst fucking spot imaginable. So I need speed here, basically. 
didn't get anything there. Got something there. Okay, it should be enough. Um, am I going to do the walkout strat, or, uh, I guess I will. So I want to go here, here, park. Get back in here. Catch me, my love. Man, okay. Job. Go get that fool. You can also dive out of your van and do that skip, but uh, yeah. All I was doing there was parking my van on a trigger, and then uh, I got out and got near D and it triggers the cutscene. Which is cool. Keep in mind, I didn't find any of these strats. I had no involvement. The people in the GT5 speedrun community are cool. And you should join too. You'll definitely do better than I am. <laughs> uh, you know. You know. The bringing up the phone thing was to do with um, stopping the dialogue, basically. Because that... You need to have hit a particular trigger, be in a particular point, within a range of D, and Franklin and Lamar can't be speaking. So I should be jumping here to not waste stamina. Okay. It's funny how that cat always gets hit by the train. Let's go, Chop. So this is uh, pushing Chop's ass. It is like one of the worst strats in the game because he doesn't cooperate. You can move into third person and run, but not too long or then he uh, stops. He's actually cooperating, and I just failed. That He's being nice, and I'm not being very good. I uh, okay, that was not very good. Okay, well you we you suck. Together, okay, we'll go, we'll go for Let's one more. Go. Okay, that was good. Um, okay. Hey, oh, like that was uh, eh. I give that an eh out of ten. Come on, chop. Eh, corresponding to like a four. Go, boy. Where that OG at? Do I expect slow van? Uh, apparently you can't get the slow van. You can't get the slow van bug if you uh, don't jump out of the van at D. So because I walked out and got near D, I should be fine. So slow van is like in this phase here. The van like won't be able to get up to like its highest gear or something. Yeah. The way I did the skip there avoids that. What is this brown car doing? Hello? Brake boost? The brown car is going to make this a little bit annoying now. Why brown car? Why? There's another like indentation brake boost somewhere along here and I... Ah, this one. Um, oh, that's cop car. Okay, well that's... Kinda limits how I could have done that turn. Thanks, man. Am I not really not gonna make it? Are you? Who doesn't make it to the point in time? Oh my god. That's embarrassing. There were just so many cars. Uh, okay. So turn around here. I'm pretty sure I want to try a mid drive. Uh, actually, I'm not sure I need to because it's over a bump. But getting a little bit of speed off the curbs there. Brake boost there. I'm going for it. Runs already shit. I'm taking the dive. Okay, missed that brake boost. Doesn't matter. Things aren't even really that clear. It. His head has to go the other way. Like where his feet were. If his head was, I would be fine. God damn it. Got to cap my FPS. Okay. There's a strat here to slide through the gate at the end, but it's not really worth it. Okay, one power. This car's in my way. Why is everything in my way? Okay. I went for the mid-drive there, but didn't get the brake boost. Got nothing out of this. This sucks. Got nothing out of that, too. Okay, go back to 150 FPS. 
Oh my god, I've got nothing, bruh. This brake boost is so hard, and it's just the mid-drive comes so quick, too. The problem with brake boost is, like, how fast you're going kind of influences whether you can get other brake boosts. So if you miss the mid-drive at the beginning, it becomes, like, I wouldn't say impossible, but a lot harder to get the other brake boosts. I don't know why I went for that one there, because there's, there's no reason to have more speed at this point. But okay, I'm just trying to show off, okay? I can get brake boosts just like everyone, chat. <laughs> okay, so this is the gate you could slide through hypothetically with a glitch, but it's, it, it's not worth the time. So, jumping over here. I mean, you can consult my facts and glitches series if you want to see that, okay? I can't do complications jump. There's no reason to. Would it still be faster? Uh, maybe. I'm not killing my runs for that. So holding shift here until I get to the door, and then stealthing means I can basically run through the house. Then going back to normal running. Third person jump into this door. Free Michael by pressing F. EF. And then a bunch of brake boosts. Uh, try to get that brake boost there. Uh, I think there's one here that I don't think everyone goes for, but you can kind of get one there. Uh, one there, one there, one there, one there, one there, one there. It's a lot of brake boosts. I think I got most of them. One there. I'm not going to go for this one. I'm going too fast as is. I slowed down way too- What is this car doing? No! Okay, it's fine. Um, is, I think I got those. It's like a- your, your brake boost going up on the curb and then going down off the curb, it's, it's, I don't know. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, don't! I wasn't gonna make it in time anyway. Which is weird, because I thought those brake boosts were fairly okay. But, apparently, yeah, as I say, I slowed, slowed down way too much on that turn. So this punch, uh, I don't want to press click immediately. Just wait a second before clicking seems to help because you can get a slow punch, but the idea is to not have any pushes here Was not very good, but it's fine. Okay, I want to go into first person here um, oh, I missed it So like you can This is a very weird save here. You can save the game like while your phone is still off screen like you just spam like up across an enter or something. What I'm doing here is save warping to Michael's house. Because warping places is good. <laughs> you can save time by warping to your destination. So I wanna. Uh, okay, well. Okay. So I ran around the yellow dot there uh, to skip a small cutscene of him opening the door. And I brought up the sleep mode spot. text to get rid of the um, help prompt. Ran at those bushes, and then I uh, turn here. This is just to make it so Franklin runs to the car. And doesn't slow down. So this car is perfectly in my way. That is, uh, it's fantastic. I love it. Gonna do a brake boost here, which I failed because of that car. Brake boost here. Uh, brake boost here. Brake boost here. White car kind of annoying. Brake boost here. Uh, brake boost on the turn. Little bit dangerous because you can kind of skid out. Brake boost there. Um, brake boost here. There's a lot of brake boost, chat. That's what I'm saying. Could brake boost here here? Yeah, why, why the fuck not? Break boost here. Uh, break boost here. Missed like the last three. Break boost there. Got that one. Here. Here. So, uh, break boost probably didn't help me because I had to slow down so much for cars. Uh, I was too focused on getting the break boost. So I want to get within the certain range of this boat. So Franklin climbs. I'm almost just trying to do all the strats, even if, like, I should hypothetically avoid one. I should have slowed down a bit here. Um, um, should be still okay. Nah, normally you get him on the boat for the, uh, gal uh, the tunnel here. But because I didn't slow down, it kind of boosted ahead. Should still be fine. But, uh, yeah. Too busy talking. But that's okay. 
So I want to slow down because the boat speed is somewhat dependent upon my speed. It's not like it'll stop if you stop, but uh, there is a relationship between the two. So I want to hang back so it stays back a bit. Um, am I not close enough to trigger that? Might have been too far back. It seemed like it took longer than it should. But yeah. It's hard to know now because normally I'm not this far along when it's at this point. So this guy, if you shoot him at any point, he will die the nanosecond that he can. He will die. Yeah. Delayed death. Okay, so I should want to accelerate here until he starts to move. Then I stop accelerating. He said dealership. Now I'm going to drive again. Uh, this is not far enough along. This is awkward. Um, should still be fine. Yeah. Okay. So you want to pick up Jimmy within like that kind of time frame so that Franklin doesn't fall down. If you pick up Jimmy later, he falls down and you, lo you lose time. Now I'm going to pick up Frankie boy. Okay. That is quite a jump, Franklin. Go off here. There's actually a break boost here, but I don't know why you do it. Like, I don't know why that doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. So you just want to get back to this uh, mechanics so that you can line up and hit a yellow dot to skip some dialogue. Okay. Didn't really get here. Had a good time. At least you still got a son. So yeah, sure after he says sun, you hit yeah. the yellow dot. Uh, scroll wheel so that you can skip the animation here. Good, now this drive. Uh, it's a mid drive at the beginning here. Where you... Mid drive. And that was absolutely terrible. That was barely an attempt. Wow. Your mid drive and brake boost going on the curve. And you normally get a brake boost here too, but I don't have the speed for it now. So I'm just going to do these kind of backup little break boosts here. Where's the other one? It is that. See a little indentation there? Right here, right here. Would you... Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, speed is good, I guess. Um, so I want... Is it this one? Or is it this one? Um, okay. Well, could have done either, I suppose, but... Yeah, the speed is pretty garbage. But that's okay. It's fine. I could do this one here, but there's no reason to. Uh, okay. It's fine. Alright. I'm going to hit the wall here to interrupt dialogue. Uh, I want to turn around very quickly here and run into here with... First person. Okay. Now I want to set up a buffered ledge grab right here. And then get into the car. Oh, the door opened for me. That's cool. Um, should be calling Michael because his door might not open for me. It sometimes does, sometimes does not. It's too slow. Yeah, okay. Got to get used to doing that. And I need to cancel it too. Does it have to connect through? I think it does. Okay. Then get out here and spam Q. Okay. Ah. Uh, was I too far left? Normally you walk back into the door. The previous times I was too far right, so I went further left than normal. Yeah. Normally you like warp ex into the door, chat, and it's really impressive. God damn it. So, uh, brake boost here. Go through this lamppost. Um, brake boost here, brake boost here. Missed one of those. Ah, uh, there's no reason to do that brake boost, because I'm going fast enough as is, and then we go up here. Oh, that's terrible. Oh no. Oh no. Ah, uh, okay. Did not deserve for that to succeed. That was really bad. <laughs> it's part angling, part speed, and I failed both parts. But I got over! Uh, can you argue a success? Yes. Yes, you can. So taking cover here and getting into the car is a little bit faster. 
Uh, for some reason, some people's games can crash taking cover there. If that ever happens to you, just don't do it. I don't know what causes it. Yeah. <clears throat> Pulling down an innocent man's house. Let's bring up the phone to stop a phone call that would stop dialogue. I've gone back a little- okay, well, I was trying to go back further because it's a bit smoother, but I'm not used to going back that far, so I kind of failed it. Uh, okay, we've got a brake boost here. Brake boost here. Brake boost here, brake boost here. And then a camera manipulation where I turn my camera like so, holding C. Apparently you can just hold C, but uh, because my camera's on C, I have to spin my camera. This turn is terrible, but it's fine. At least the guys didn't spawn. And the mission is over. Wow. Hey. Thanks, Martin Madrazo's guys just let me go. Crazy. So it's very important I get a bike here. Technically, it's only important for the full run that I get a bike here. But I'm basically practicing for the full run with segments. So I, I'll go for a bike. You basically dupe uh, the bike later. There is no parked cars because the game hates me. Dog, get me a bike. Bitch. Because I'm assuming the dog's female. Hello? You know how it is. You fucker. Um. I do not see anything up there. Okay. Uh, do not see any bikes at all, which is a terrible sign. Oh, it's a bike. So ideally, you take the bike without shooting a gun. Because uh, if you shoot a gun, the cars freak out. Can these cars just slow down a bit, please? Thank you. Cool. Um. For some reason, right, I've been told that this bike is meant to be, like, rare in this section, but save warping or something makes it appear more frequently. And, like, the fastest bike in the game is meant to be more common, but because of stuff we do before, uh, it doesn't traditionally spawn, which sucks. But uh, this bike is good for this section. I'm not disappointed. I mean, I'm disappointed with, like, 90% of the other things that happen in this run, but that's okay. It's fine. Uh, so, I want to dive off here. That's the only thing that I need to remember. Yeah, and then, then, then going through the door, win first person. Right, okay. A turn was pretty sub-optimal. Uh, this is speed and angle, apparently. Perfect. Okay, cool. You got it, Michael. Don't be sad. Uh, so, I jumped there and brought up my phone to skip some dialogue. Now, for here, you want this door to close as soon as possible. So, you want to just sneak out the door. You sneak out the door and that enables you to run immediately. If you don't do that, then you have to wait for the door to close to get normal speed again. So just uh, some speed here. Uh, slight optimization going through here. Coolio. And then this is like the most basic try for the game because you can't break boost with a bike. But you still have to like uh, kind of line yourself up and try to get some wheelies. Because uh, with this bike... At least it seems that way, unless you go over curves. Me going over curves will be different, but you need to go for, like, for a long time before it really starts doing a major wheelie. Like, you have to go very straight, I mean. One of my least favorite strats is coming up, and it's so unimportant. It's taking cover on a table, and then moving off that table to get yourself some speed. <laughs> and uh, I hate it. I'm tempted just to never do it, because it's just, it's just so, it's so tiny, and I never get it correct. Uh, ah, excuse me. Excuse me. I got this interview. So, buying a shirt and uh, teleporting through the rack, as you do. Yo, as uh, cool getting get. these pants, it, and then right? taking cover here, and then... I did it! Oh my god, it was slow, but I did it! Wow! I didn't hold shift that time, I think that's the secret. Okay, interrupt Lester's phone call. Don't care. Okay. I gotta start remembering to clear my text. I always forget to do that. So, on the way back, I wanna clear the phone. Okay, so we are trying to stay kind of in the middle here. Ah, oh, no, this is bad. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Just had to slow down a little bit. It's cool. So, I'm gonna be trying to activate this yellow dot on its very edge so that I can be close to or up on the curb. Ah, it's not really close enough. 
all that does is, if you're like a hand closer to the curb, when you come out, your bike will be turned around, facing in the direction I need to go, you know? So we're getting first person here, following Ricky here, the greatest hacker of all time. Clearly. Lester Inc. got nothing. Why do we have the clear text? It's so that we can quickly make phone calls later. In, in this case, it's so we can immediately kill uh, Mark Zuckerberg. You know. I, I couldn't remember his real name. Um, Zuckerberg, I don't know. So you want to clear these very quickly so you don't get an extra pop-up. Mouse superiority. Yeah. <laughs> Jay Norris. That's the guy's name. Of course. And that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? <laughs> okay. So still moving in first person here. Still fastest. Sneak through the door. Want to not move my camera. And through here. It's funny because if you could mission fail here, I'm pretty sure it'd warp you out of the building at some point, but there's no way to mission fail. And it sucks. Yeah. Got nothing but to move very slow. Slight optimization is uh, going through these two guys. Sneak through here. Yeah. Nailed it. And so you'll notice out here that my bike won't be turned around because I failed at the beginning. See? And I'm gonna go back that way. Okay, so clear my text messages. Hit a car, just as I planned. I didn't plan that chat, I'm lying to you. I'm trying to act like a big shot. <laughs> um, turning here, uh, not an amazing turn. Up here. Okay, into here. Now I'm gonna park my car as if, I, no, my bike as if I was gonna dupe it, even though I'm not going to, because the run will end before that point. But uh, it's basically there, maybe a little bit more left. Um, jumps here. I think I was meant to be holding right click while jumping there. If you hold right click while jumping, like you, you can do more jumps. It's not necessarily, I don't think it's faster, but when you're making turns um, very quickly, having shorter jumps is better. Should go to the bathroom. Let us kill Jay Zuckerberg, Mark's brother, of course, of course. <clears throat> I did wash my hands, at least two thirds of my hand had some amount of water on it before I left the bathroom. Gotta save time, chat. Uh, so spamming up here. Um, actually scrolling is normally fast, I should have had my hand on my mouse there. So I want to cap my FPS to 30 to get this jump. Like There's just a few frames where the jump is possible and by having lower FPS, the frames last longer. Uh, I'm not super strong on this movement. Um, okay, yep, yeah, okay, cool. Um, tried to put my FPS back to normal and I failed. So we're gonna go over here, and then run, and then third person. Okay, uh, I think I should have jumped when I was getting that phone call. Yeah, so we jump to avoid some slowdown here. Okay, um, go into first person and push Jizzle down the stairs, but not too much down the stairs. And then we turn on this little grate here, so Jizzle runs to the car, ran around the front of the car. Little bit suboptimal. And now it's just like 57 bajillion brake boosts like normal. What are these two cars? I mean, brake boost? Come on, man. Um, well, I can't go on the right side of the road, which is the place. Okay, well, go back over here. Brake boost. Brake. Ah, okay. Well, I missed them all. I was. Okay, well, now I'm too slow to get the rest. That's great. This, this is, this is fine. This is okay. Hello to you too, pedestrian. Please die and get out of my way. Missed that brake boost too. Okay. I'm not normally going this slow. 
Okay. Uh, so, I was so committed to getting that brake boost that I didn't think about, you know, getting through the cars. Fuck brake boost, chat. I mean, to be real, my main interest is in doing the strats to remind myself that they exist as opposed to doing them correctly. But still. There's a brake boost there onto the curb here. Uh, but I don't think I did in the right spot. That is one that I need to look at. That one and the one in the movie studio. Okay, so we park the car here. And unfortunately... I hate this development, but uh, people are now actually do uh, bunny hop strats. Bunny hop strats are cancer. So when you bunny hop, like multiple times, you go really fast. But the base speed of this bike is actually slower than the other bike that you can take. So the only way to make this faster is with the bunny hopping. And so you just gotta kinda hope that the people don't get in your way. Uh, or that you can maneuver yourself around them before they jump into you. Uh, the, okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's, it's, it's fine. It's fine. No. It's, okay, back this way, please. Okay, thank you. Okay, well, ooh, okay. Okay. Bike normally up that part there and then over here. Okay. More bunny hopping. Now I want to break and hit a tree. I can't remember if hitting the tree is significant, but I think it just stops you faster. Yeah, okay. Um, so this is hard. So you want to look to the left here to enable a uh, boat to spawn, and then you steal the boat. Can I go up, please? Okay, thank you. So, you wouldn't think stealing a boat's faster, but if you're in a boat, it automatically activates the cutscene and you don't have to actually climb into the thing here. Okay, climb. Um, okay. I don't know if I'm meant to stay in first person that entire time. So you just battle charge at this thing. Okay, so you didn't have to climb in the boat. So then we shoot these guys here. Perfect. I want to call my phone call. You killed them. Oh my god, this isn't happening. Just call down. Um I did what I had to do. Uh take you back to your brother. Okay. Had to wait. If I went too far, it wouldn't have skipped the dialogue. Uh Tracy had like an extra line of dialogue there, so I the phone didn't initiate. As soon as I thought it would, but whatever. It's fine. So I need to uh, do a save warp here. Oh, <laughs> go stress low. Um, I, I'm pressing up too much. See how, like, when the phone came up, I was already selecting above? It's because I tapped too much, but oh, whatever. Whatever. It's fine. So now we can do, a, like, a hangout warp with Franklin to get Michael closer to where I need to be. Um, oh, and don't want to be in first person here, because for some reason it makes you slower at this particular point in the game. Hang out with Franklin. Immediately hang up without discussing plans, get myself a suit, wait for a text message. Change to Franklin. Uh, this is to make the next text message come in earlier. I run over here and then I switch to Michael. Uh, see how my brakes kind of tapped there? Um, if I held W during it, it would be bad. Uh, it would, uh, fuck the... Uh, it would fuck the text message coming in. So there's one here, like one here, and then one... Ah, uh, I missed the third one, okay. I mean, there's more down here that I don't... Like this one and this one. Uh, di I didn't... The, the tutorial that I watched didn't show that. Well, it's not a tutorial, it's just a person's... There's a list of like the community goals, like the best anyone has done any segment, and you can look them up and uh, compare yourself to them, which is very cool. And that's kind of what I'm learning off. So I'm learning from everyone, basically. Moving up here in third person is the fastest, for some reason. And then uh, first person here. I think jumping at the bottom of those stairs is something I should have done. Mm. Oh man, am I going to be able to do these straps? Probably not. 
Okay, the break boosts here are brutal. Your FIB and they're buddy, not powered yeah. breakers, so they're no, certainly not that important. But like you can like, one, two, you three. I checked out the WPP thing. Uh, is Does there one more like there? One here? No. Okay. Well, for starters, they, uh, they don't put There's like 57 hard break boosts there. Oh, uh, there was two cop cars. Uh, two. Two. I'm like, well, that cop car's gone far enough. Even if I tap this guy, I'll be fine. And it's just like two. Were they having a party? A pizza party for fucking cops? Fuck off. There's another cop car! Um. Uh. So maybe dying would have been preferable here. I mean, in real life, just hit me with a brick. No. Um. So I will just, uh. I actually don't know if it fails me for bringing the cops here. What? There's a cop on the side of the road? <laughs> uh. No, obviously, if I took the cops to the actual jewel store, I'd fail, but I don't know if, like, as it showed there, it doesn't fail me for taking them close to it. Except that there's a guy on the side of the road who's a cop. Fucking overachiever. God. Okay, I need to look up these breakfasts again. What are you what are you doing, Black Car? Come on! Awful. Uh yeah, I, I can't count that one either. Dang it. Is it is it here? Yeah, that's the one. Okay, that's the one I normally fail at. Um no, that's not a break boost. This one is though. Okay. Okay. Uh, this bus is interesting. So is this truck. Couldn't do the break boost there. Then we uh do this, and then we do uh, another one here, and go between these cars and don't get hit. Then we spin on. Okay, there's the cars. Then we. What the fuck? Okay. Well. I I I I got it, and then I ah. God damn it. You warp, want to warp out on that pine tree. Don't know why it didn't give, me the, give it to me the second time. I'm going to jump here. Take a picture. Sir, thank you. I did too long. There we go. Okay. Now I can... There's... So you're meant to tap your power on and off with his first dialogue, but very quickly. I held it just that little bit too long. Uh, I could have locked my FPS there to try for a frame perfect jump, but uh, I did not. Even when I make mistakes, as long as I know why I made the mistake, it's fine. So normally this would let me warp in from like a bajillion miles away, but I can't because the uh, I'm not on the tree as readily as I should be. Try a similar sort of thing here with these boxes. Yeah, I didn't get that one either. Get the fuck out of here with your bullshit game. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, I should have done a jump there. And instead, I did the jump way too late. Perfect. Great. Uh, jumping up this ladder and then bringing out my pistol so I can do a little maneuver like that. And then run into a wall because it's the kind of guy that I am. Climbing up here. Balancing. Scary. Running up here. Third person climbing is faster than first person climbing. I think I should stay in third person here because I'm going to be jumping here anyway. Jump here. Jump. Jump. This movement is only possible on this patch. And I still failed it. Cool. Okay. Uh, climb here. Bring out my gun. Third person. Uh, did I put away the gun? Uh, hopefully I did. I did. It would have failed me. So yeah, the gun's still in my hand, but it's technically already put away. Cool. If you roll off there with the gun in your hands, you uh, fail immediately. Can I can't warp to my car. Normally I could, but I can't. It's terrible. The reason why I said that movement's not possible on the newest patch is because you can't change camera while climbing in the newest patch. Being able to change camera while climbing leads to some uh, weird oddities, like clipping through walls and stuff that will that is later in the run. Uh, didn't go for any break boost there. Can go for one here though. That was a terrible landing. Oh my god. 
I'm gonna go through this little crack here. Anything else? Um, I do not remember where the brake boosts are here. There's like one or two, I think. This looks like one, but... Ah, uh, yeah. Not super important, considering I'm slowing down anyway. But... Flatten myself here. Go up here. Now I want to dive out, because diving out is fun for the whole family. And dive. Nailed it. Nailed it. Jesus indeed. So I want to spam enter here. Scroll up to select. Run down here in first person. Third person jumping may be better, I don't know. Um, so I want to aim my gun here. Aiming the gun delays Franklin's phone call. Oh, I didn't break my glass! Oh, right, that was a thing. So normally, during like the previous segment, I've already broken the glass in my window. But Michael puts down his gun for a nanosecond to break that glass and then the phone call comes through. Right. Uh, it just means I have to wait a little bit, like just a tiny amount here for this. We were discussing before whether sleep mode was even necessary anymore. Uh, yeah it is, apparently. Apparently Ricky's phone call can come through here. Uh, this is terrible RNG. My goal here is to get a particular text message, making sleep mode which blocks phone calls normally quite valuable. However, if I aim down the side of my gun, that also blocks phone calls. Therefore sleep mode isn't necessary, I just need to not be bad. Ah, there are no more phone calls, chat. There it is. I mean, was that unlucky? Yes, but it was a good learning experience. So we're gonna park the car up here to make the carbine rifles truck go faster. <laughs> there were no phone calls in this mission. Bring out my phone. This truck is in the way. Um, did I get him? No, I did not. I, I didn't get him either. So ideally, you don't kill this guy. Please don't kill me. Okay. So, uh... Uh, I do not know why the cops spawned immediately. Did I move my horn button somewhere? I did. Uh... Where did I move my horn button? Um... I have to go. B. That's right. B. Thank you. B for B. I mean, I'm not wrong. I mean, was that a factor in my decision? No, but B does stand, stand, for, stand for B or start with B or whatever, you know. Anyway, so was that terrible? Yes, but it's fine, Chad. It's fine. All right. Waiting on you, kid. Okay, so running down here, uh, these brake boosts are like the hardest in the game. Well, at least in this section. I'm still gonna, okay, beep, beep, so they run faster. I, my turn here is terrible. I, did I run over that cat? It's fine, it's fine. I'm still doing the movement at the beginning here differently, but that's okay. So there is no mid drive here, but uh, I need this turn to be at least half decent. It was pretty bad. So, you're kind of trying to use the power um, as you're changing gear. You want to be in fifth gear so you can do this powered brake boost at the end here. Okay, got it. But I used my power like 886,000, 2 billion and 24 times. Okay, did not get that one. I'm I'm worse at that, lo that one there. Ah, uh, and I didn't get that one there because I never go for it because I'm terrible. All right, listen up. There's like four or five brake boosts in this entire section, which I just do not like. Um, yeah, I won't go for this one. Okay, that was uh, actually pretty decent for me. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna shoot those cases over there. I didn't get the one that I wanted, but it's fine. So shooting these cases and grabbing the gold from them is uh, fast. Getting the bare minimum, of course. I don't need their money. Do I need this case? I think I do. Yeah. 
and then jump through here. Okay, it's a little bit slow. So this strategy, I will fail. There is no doubt in my mind that I will fail this strategy because it took me like 10 attempts to get it once and I've only done it once. So it was submitted to Facts and Glitches, a way to take the bikes out of this mission. And they happen to do a strategy that is really fast where you can't fail this section if you're looking at your friends. So you can move out of their range that you would normally fail, um, but you don't fail as long as you look at them. So the fastest way to do this mission is to do it blind. Look backwards at all times, um, looking at them. Uh, that's not it, it's the next one, right? Or is it that one? Oh shit, it was that one, wasn't it? No, it's this one, okay. Um, Uh, please. Okay. It's, it's fine. It's fine, Jeff. It's probably not fine. It's probably very bad, but okay. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I guess it's. it's, it's... <clears throat> it's very hard, alright? I'll get it the second time, Jeff. Wait a second. I should be going down here, too. So there's a slight. Movement fail at the beginning too. Uh, it's a wall. That's a wall, chat. Educational. Um. Oh my God! See, the, the the cars can also fuck you. Um. So one there. It's the next one, right? Uh, was that it? Yeah, that was it. Okay. Um. Is that it? Yeah, that's not it. Is, was that it? So that's no, that's not the first yellow thing. It's, this is the first yellow thing. Oh shit. There, there, see, see, and, and sometimes I just don't see it because I'm. Okay. Speed is pretty good. Um, turning at the end though. Ah, uh, that's a wall. So definitely want to be in uh, more in the middle there. <laughs> and and no one gets it a hundred percent, you know, because you can still run into cars even if you do everything perfectly. That's one. I mean, they could just not be in a car there, game. You, just, you, know you stayed? Okay, this one here. Okay. Okay. Just imagine the time save when I get this right the first time the next time. Um, are they over, are they over more? So it's about here, right? Yeah, that's okay. Yeah. Um, so I guess that green sign is a good indicator. So they're more over this way now. Stay more middle. Um, is it just here, turning? No, it's more. Uh, could have totally hit them there, in, on the map. Uh, that should have succeeded. A crew member was abandoned is the good text, I think. Yay, I did it! Only took six attempts. There was definitely a huge time save chat after all this. <laughs> ah. So what do uh, this car really fucks me? But merge over here. Go up on the side here. Down for some curves. 
You worry about the loot, I'll worry about the cops. If you need another gun, give me the word. Feels slower than I should be. Flawless. Lester's waiting for us at the lockup. Okay. So was this run good? No. Hell no. Was it nice to do a speed run again? Yes. It's good to have splits again. So my PB is 1 hour and 20 seconds. If I had done none of the new strats, I probably would have saved like 10 minutes. Because <laughs> I just, you know. But you can see, there's a lot of new stuff. That I'm, uh, that I need to refine myself on. Think of how much I'm going to save next chat, next run chat compared to these uh, splits. This was 259th on the leaderboard. Yikes. <laughs> Next time though, chat. Next time. I regret everything.